Hi everyone, so in this video we're gonna learn about this. Okay everyone, so in this video we're gonna learn how to change app icons on your iPhone using shortcuts in 2020, right? So as you can see I have this uh, Spotify app with a different icon. So we're gonna change the Instagram icon on this uh, iPhone. So we're gonna use iPhone's own app shortcuts, right? If you don't have shortcuts, you can go to App Store and search for Shortcuts Apple. Like so, click on search and go down to this one, shortcuts with this app icon. Click on install. In my case, I already have it installed, all right? And after that, we're gonna go and get this Instagram icon. All right, so to do this, we're gonna open up Safari. On Google, we're gonna search for icons eight. Like so, click on search. And go into this one, icons8.com. Now we're gonna search for Instagram. Click on the green search icon. Go down and now we get these uh, Instagram app icons. So just choose the one you want to have. So let's say I want to have this one. All right, so to get this icon, just take your finger and hold it on the icon. So you get this uh, pop-up and then click on this one, add to photos. Like so. So now you have this icon on your photos application. So just open up your photos app. And now we can see that we have this app icon right here. All right. So now we're going to go and click on shortcuts. Click on this one, create shortcut. So just click on this uh, plus sign. Now click on add action. Click on this one, scripting, and click on this one under apps, open app. Under scripting, we're going to click on this one, choose. And now choose the app you want to change your app icon on. In my case, I'm going to choose Instagram. So we find Instagram right here. If you don't find it, you can just search for your app. Like so. Now click on your app. And now go to the top right corner. Click on this one. Next. And now we're going to add a shortcut name. So this can be whatever you like. But I'm going to use Instagram. The same name as the app. Like so. So after that just go up to the top right corner. Click on done. And now we can see the new Instagram shortcut right here. Let's go to the three dots in the top right corner of your new shortcut. Just click on this one. And now go to the top right corner and click on these three dots. And now we're going to go and click on this one, add to home screen. So click on add to home screen. Go under home screen name and icons and click on the icon. Click on choose photo. And now just locate the photo you want to use for your app. So I'm going to use this one for my Instagram app. And after that just go to the bottom right corner, click on choose. Like so. Now go to the top right corner, click on add. So add it to home screen and just go and click on done in the top right corner. Like that, just close this uh, shortcut application. And now we can see that we have this new app icon for Instagram. So I'm going to move this to another screen, hold the icon. And move it wherever you want. So I'm just going to add it next to the new Spotify. Click on home screen to remove this uh, delete option. Now we can see that we have two Instagram apps. 
That's because this is just a shortcut. If I click on this new Instagram app icon, this will open up uh, the shortcut application for a quick second and then open up your application, in my case, Instagram. Okay? So what we can do is we can hide this uh, original Instagram app. So just take the finger and point to this application and hold down and move it to another screen. So in my case, I'm going to move it to this screen. And as you can see, I have both uh, Spotify and uh, Instagram. So to make these uh, disappear in a folder, I'm going to take my finger and hold it on the application and drag it over Spotify like so and release it in this new folder. Okay. Click on home screen and click on home screen one more time. Now you can see that we have this folder with the application that we just changed the app icons on. Okay, so we have the new right here, Instagram and Spotify, and we have the original in the folder. We can also hold the finger on the folder and click on rename. So you can rename this to short cuts apps and just close this folder like so. So now you can see that we have this shortcut apps. So we know that this is the original uh, app folders. All right. If you change your mind and want to reverse this, and if you want to delete uh, a shortcut, we can just hold the finger on the shortcut. So in my case, Instagram, and just move it around and release, and we get this delete option. Just click on delete, delete this uh, Instagram app, click on delete like so, click on home button, now go to shortcuts, application, and just take your finger and hold on the shortcut you want to delete, and just go down and click on this one, delete. So this shortcut will be deleted from all of your iCloud devices, if you're sure, click on delete shortcut, like so. Now if I go back, we can see that this shortcut is gone. We can now go to the folder. Just take your finger, hold it on the app, and just move it out from the folder, like so, and release and click on home screen. And now we got your original application back to normal. Okay, everyone, so this is how you can change app icons on your iPhone using shortcuts in 2020. I hope this helped. Okay everyone, so I hope this uh, video helped you out. If you like this one, you can give a thumbs up, you can leave a comment below. You can also subscribe to my channel right here for more of these videos. And please check out my latest video right here. So I hope you have an awesome day. Take care and bye.